Well, the holiday travel rush kicks off today. Yes. And experts predict this Thanksgiving will be one of the busiest holidays for travel ever. That's why I'm happy I'm not getting on a plane. <laughs> Me too. Well, here in the tri-state, more than 8.5 million people are expected to use Port Authority airports, bridges, and tunnels. And most of those people will be driving to their holiday destinations, but officials say traffic will be similar to pre-pandemic levels in 2019. The big concerns are at the airports. The Port Authority says nearly 3 million passengers are expected to pass through Newark, LaGuardia, and JFK airports over the next week. That's more than last year's record-setting travel. Eyewitnesses reporter Morgan Norwood has more from LaGuardia. David Shade, that's right. The holiday Thanksgiving travel rush kicking off here at LaGuardia Airport with the TSA estimating that they'll screen more than 30 million passengers at airports all across the country. The busiest days are going to be next Tuesday and Wednesday in terms of when to travel. That is when just over 2 million passengers will come through TSA and then the return home. That's also going to be busy. That Sunday after Thanksgiving, TSA expects to hustle nearly 3 million people through airports across the country. But the agency is promising to keep those wait times down under 30 minutes for regular 10 minutes for pre check. But travelers that we spoke with here at LGA, they are not taking any chances. They got here early to avoid that rush. Can you give yourself some extra time to navigate yes. through? Yeah. We did. Not this time. We just plan. We're, we don't want to be catched and caught in our rush. So, How early did you get here? Oh, very early because our flight uh, should leave at 9 p.m. Nine. But we're trying to see if we can get an earlier flight. So again, a good idea to get to the airport early, maybe budget in an extra 45 minutes to even an hour to make sure that your travel uh, goes pretty smoothly here. In terms of the airlines, they promise that they've got this under control. They've added tens of thousands of employees to make sure that, you know, they can handle the influx of crowds expected this holiday season.